Hi, this is Jethro Jones, host of the Transformative Principal Podcast and Transformative Leadership Summit. I'm excited to share some teasers with you from the summit coming to you July 31st. So get on over to transformativeleadershipsummit.com and sign up for this amazing educational leadership conference. While you are there, go ahead and get the all-access pass at the special early bird rate. Enjoy this teaser with Jennifer Abrams. I have two thoughts. I have two thoughts. Number one, can you use quick scripts? So you don't have to plot out something that's con, you know, it's just to be so convoluted and it's just, there's so many places to go with this person. You don't even know where to begin. Can you start literally with what, um, I put in as a quick script and I, I, I honor Carrie Patterson's work on crucial conversations. This is the three, three sentence thing I really like from them. Um, it's to state my path. Do you, can you practice three sentences? I noticed I'm beginning to feel, do you see that? So I, I share with, um, with people that I had a colleague at, when I was in the English department at a, at a high school and his name was Mark. And so girls came into the uh, bullpen of the English department and they said, Mr. So-and-so. And he said, what do you want? I thought, okay, that's not good. Next kid came in, same thing. And I said to him, you know, Mark, I noticed when those two girls came in that you said, what do you want? And I'm thinking that if I was them, that tone might be really intimidating. Did you hear yourself? Now, that took eight seconds. So how can you prepare yourself to go into the deep end of the pool? This is sort of a floaties, hard conversation. You place something out there that your brain went down a path it had an impact and you need to share. I've had these conversations had with me about comments that I've said in a workshop uh, that were politically leaning, that the person said distracted him and he needed me to be aware of that. I've had people say that, that I've mentioned something that was offensive. When that happens in that eight seconds, it's not only how you say it, which is a practice, but I also really think that a transformational leader hears it and receives feedback. So you could practice being on the receiving end and how you respond to it. You could be on the delivering end and do it. So you get a bunch of chances to to actually work on the giving and receiving of feedback. And I think like putting your, your hand, literally when you're receiving feedback, not going like this. Oh yeah, I'm up for that. But literally putting your palms down, right. And saying, okay, I'm open. I'm open to it. And I trust myself that I'm going to stand in this and hear it and not fall over or now go back at the person. So the question is, what are some of the responses you could have? And that's in another book that I wrote too. So, I mean, it's just, you got to live in the deep end emotionally, both sides.